So, all right, let's just start off. Sure. What is CyberArk? So CyberArk is uh, a leader in the originally privilege access management space. Right. Over probably the past six or seven years, we've kind of redefined what privilege means. Right. So we've become more of an identity security company. So whenever you have to think about identity and credentials and where those credentials live, how to manage them, uh, how to authenticate against them, that's, that's really what we do. Now we'll always be in that PAM space. It's what we have eight, 9,000 plus customers. Um, a lot of the leading uh, of industry in Fortune 100, 500, um, but we've really expanded beyond just that traditional privilege access management into really anything identity related. When I think of um, identity access management, um, I think of uh, really making sure that who they, someone says they are, they really are. Correct. Uh, how do you do that? So we authenticate a bunch of, uh, we, we take our solution to authenticate against a bunch of different identities. Because we could talk about this forever now, it's becoming such a different landscape where not even five, 10 years ago, like an organization may only have, it was five to 10 identities per employee. So right. simple, a thousand employees, you have you know five to 10,000 identities. That number has now grown to 40 to 50 to 60 identities per employee. So now a thousand employee company has 60,000 different identities. Wow. As it relates to um, the privilege portion, mm -hmm. well, at least the way most of us think about it, uh, what we're really saying in fundamental terms is individuals have access to certain amounts of or types of information based upon their authority role sure. or their designation with an organization. Is that pretty much spot on? Correct. I mean, uh, least, least privilege or role-based access controls, those things have been around forever. The traditional kind of PAM or privileged piece usually stems down to your, your root and admin accounts, servers. Mm -hmm. You know, we, we, all of our businesses, we have to have all of our data and store things on these different servers. And, and those accounts are, are typically shared, right? Mm -hmm. you think of a, a 10 to 20 IT, a person IT team in small numbers. Well, they have hundreds of servers and each one of them might have access to, cert to a certain number of them.